I just think finals has a, a different intensity. Um, it's a different, completely different ball game um, in that regard. I think anything can happen uh, in those situations. And we've seen it in previous years in different sports and different codes, everything. So um, you just don't know what to expect. We try not to focus on the teams. I think it's more um, us and what we need to do. So I think it's all around how we um, control our emotions, how we control anything that's thrown at us. So um, I think I think it's in our hands. We do do a bit of a dance in the changing room um, before our games. It basically just started with Summer one day. She was just teaching one of the girls a dance and then we all sort of were like, oh, this is fun. And then we all sort of got up doing it and now it's just like a little ritual so we're all masked up and um in our little lines and we just do it and we've learned a couple of different ones over the season and i absolutely love it it's one of those yeah one of those team bath again find themselves in the final four and um, with spectators going to be allowed at the copper box arena i think we're just completely excited and just looking forward to the challenge that it pre it's going to present itself i have got my husband uh, my mum and my darling baby girl, um, who's, who's going to be 10 months old, so um, they will be cheering from the crowd, um, and I'm super excited about that. Not only for me playing for myself, but for Savannah and wanting to be a good role model and to inspire other women out there to know that oh, during their maternity leaves, it, it, you can achieve great things as well. When you get to play with your friends in a game where you've developed a level of maturity and you're having so much fun, I think it makes it extra special. So, to be fair, the Team Bar fans are, are the best in the league. They always come out and rep in terms of the blue and gold. It's just a shame we haven't been able to have like home matches this season. In general, the level of support that we get from the blue and gold, whether it's near, far, it has been absolutely terrific. And we're looking forward to hopefully seeing more of them at the finals weekend in their blue and gold, decked out in their wigs and their face paint um, and cheering the team along.